Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to bout number two of the evening is fight proudly brought to you by HTC Roofing. And we fought under modified tie rules, knees to the body, no elbows, 54 kilo weight division, three by two minute rounds. Your referee judge, Mr. Brian Murphy. <laughs> Firstly, fighting out of the blue on a train by Glenn Cook at the ultimate gymnasium. She weighed in at 53.3 kilograms and hails from Helen Vale. She's wearing black tie shorts with white and black writing. Fight record of four fights, one win, one draw. Ladies and gentlemen, Stephanie Jane Taylor. And her opponent fighting out of the red corner, trained by Mark Pease at Strike Force Gym. She weighed in at 53.6 kilograms and hails from Burley Heads, wearing multi coloured tie shorts. Perfect fight record of one fight for one win. Ladies and gentlemen, Hannah Torfi! Both fighters the sensory. All right, girls, you both know the rules. All wants a good, clean fight. Listen to my command at all times. Okay, in case of a knockdown, I'll point to the nearest neutral corner. That's the corner you must Looking go to. to all right, fight. defend yourself at all times point. and good luck. The only one on the card. Mm -hmm. All right, girls, it's touch gloves. Helen Bay. No, 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 that's up here. Glenn Cook is between. That's up. All right, the girls touch gloves. Round one. And the nerve signals them to begin. High tie guard on both girls. Oh. Right round kick for Hanaf. that high round kick. Stephanie, as per is typical with ultimate, has good hands. They get into the grapple, Stephanie gets dumped. That'll go, that'll go well for Hanif. Good start. Enough, I'm sorry. Oh, tries to, tries to go with the jumping right round. Oh, here come the knees, here come the knees. Oh, and Stephanie squeezes out a right hand. Finds its mark. That's a very tight grapple. Stephanie's kneeing for dear life. And Hanaf locks her up at the leg before the Murph separates them. Action resumes. A few lumps on Hanaf's head by now. Stephanie's got the high guard. She uses the front leg to bring her in. Closing to apply those hands. Hanaf's trying to get the kicks in. Not as assured with the punches, but she squeezes one out and snaps Stephanie's head back. Up with the right round kick. It might be tight tie in style, but certainly not in pace. It's a very quick first round. Hanaf tends to connect and then shut her eyes. <laughs> oh, misses with the kick. Stephanie punishes her with the hands, trying to make up for that dump, but she's not okay, going to get it. Hanaf has got her locked in tight. The Murph separates them. She's right, good in the grapple, Hanaf. If anything, that's where she seems to be at her strongest. Oh, switches up. Oh, lands the right hand on Stephanie's chin. Stephanie's not to be put off. Coming in with the straight punches. Enough turns her back. Stephanie with the right leg. Enough with the right leg. Enough's trying to walk in there and tie her up. Apply those knees. But Stephanie is back and out of danger. Closes with the hands again. Nice knee. Yep, knee to the midsection. Another knee to the midsection from, from Stephanie. Trying, Stephanie trying to pull, bring the head down. And the end of the round. End of the round. I think mean, Stephanie weathered more damage during that round, but I think she probably also scored a little more as well. And us looking a bit more relaxed. There's nothing to relax you like a punch in the face, I always say. Okay, the Murphy strikes with the touch gloves. And we're away. And up favouring that right leg and being punished by Stephanie on the way in. Oh, Stephanie with the right hand. And up seems to be pouring. Her punches seem to come out palm first rather than knuckle first, but now she's got the knees. Now she's applying the knees to Stephanie's midsection. Right, 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 right. And up is trying to squirm out of that hole, but Stephanie's got her tight. Oh. Stephanie coming back in. She likes that. She likes to start off that right leg. Good right hand, but it's not going to do much for her, I'm afraid. Swing the knees into Stephanie's thighs. Stephanie's, right, 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 right. Stephanie's tying her up, but not really working in that grapple. Would you agree, Lucy? She's pushing her into the ropes. Do you think there's any value in it? Well, it just closes... It just closes Hanif down a bit and gets her composed for counter-attack. She's going to need a... Bit. Oh, good push kick. Drives enough into the corner. Right hand driving enough into the corner. Stephanie's now applying the knees in the grapple. 
She's used the punches to close the range and now the, now the knees are going in. Oh, enough pushes her away. The girls compose themselves. Stephanie again with that right round kick. Stephanie pushing her into the corner, trying to get those knees in. Leaves, let's go with the push kick. Now she's walking in with the hands. She reminds me a bit of Anthony Vella's zombie walking style with those punch, punch, lock up and then throw the knees. Oh, enough with the right leg. Have we seen her kick off the left? That's my question. Again with that right leg and Stephanie makes the most of it. Landing the punches. The punches, the punches close enough down but they don't seem to slow her very much. Would you agree, Lucy? Yeah, that's right. I just think that it's sort of, um, the other girl, Hannah sort of likes to counter off those punches. That's Let's true. End of round number two. End of round two. I'm still thinking, I think Stephanie's slowly pulling we away from it. I think she's busier, I think she's landing more techniques. Yeah, absolutely. I think Stephanie, have a look in at her quite record. She's the most experienced one now of the two. That's now her experience is starting to come in. I think I'd give that to Stephanie. Good round to Stephanie. So, third and final round for the girls now. They start to clasp the nerves, gives them, gives them some instructions and a wink. And they're away. Um, what, what's the bet that right leg's going to come up? And that's going to throw a big one. Oh, no, and she walks straight into Stephanie's hands. Stephanie's punching, lands the knee and the kick. Stephanie's very intent on making those punches work for her. And I think she's succeeding. Oh, finds, finds enough with the jab, opens up with a fusillade of punches, but it doesn't look like too many of them actually land, unfortunately. Enough's not to be daunting credit to her, Lucy. She's not going to be put off. She's not giving up. Important thing for a girl with one fight and a win under her belt. I mean, at least a loss will make you hungry. Alright girls, come on, let's go. Our last round. This is it. Girl circle. It's probably the best round we've seen. It's the most thoughtful. They're not flying at each other quite so much like fighting roosters. Now they're looking, looking to place their techniques. Stephanie's locked it up enough in an awkward way and tried to bring her onto the canvas. If anything, has brought herself down. The move separates them. Mark Pease is telling this girl to use a push kick. When Stephanie comes in. Come on, Oh, there's the round kick and the right hand. Stephanie pushes her away. Big knee. Big knee. Oh, and the right leg from Stephanie. I think Stephanie's well and truly got this one in the bag, Lucy. I think she's I think she's rested control of the fight. Absolutely. The best enough can do now. Try and stay clear and learn from experience. Oh, big punches, big punches in the last 30 seconds from Stephanie. She's hunting for the knockout. Hanaf is fighting back though. Hanaf has still got her poise. She's throwing that right kick, but still to no avail. Work, work, work. Come on, let's go, huh? Come on, girls, let's go. Go, Both girls seem to have shaken off the tiredness of the second round. Come on now, let's go. It's not hand something up, you often up, see. And there's the belt. <laughs> and <laughs> Hannah puts <laughs> back to her corner. Hannah looked quite tired in that third round. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of Muay Thai action, we've gone to the judges' scorecards. And all your judges score it. To a unanimous point decision, blue corner, and Stephanie, Stephanie gets the Jane win. Taylor. So that's five wins for Stephanie. Well, I think Hannah should, um, should feel okay about this. We can only be take a better fighter for the future. I think that's definitely the case. And it really rams home what Thai gyms have to realise when they're fighting in Western countries, that they can't neglect their hands.